Alright, I am back, and since it's probably the start of a new episode, good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. Whenever you may be. It's a bit more half-starved. And I'm just going to pick up where I left off last time, because I was in the middle of playing still. I just nipped away to grab a drink. Which I should have done before I started recording. Okay, what have we got? Nothing's grown yet. <laughs> um, I was waiting for some trees over here, but they're going to take ages. Got a zombie head. I don't know what I can do with that right now. Although, I'm a player head short, because I did die last time to that thingy, so I'm just going to use that zombie head in its place. Which puts my death count up to 6, 6, 13, 19, 20. Brilliant. 20 deaths. Wow. Right, I think I had some stuff in here. Oh yeah, I was doing that earlier, wasn't I? I think that's the last of it as well. Oh, maybe not quite. Please be a full block, please be a full block, please be a... Oh shit, it's half a block. That's gonna, just going to be stuck in there. Unless I put two glass panes back in there, which will round it out to a whole block. It'll take a while. I'll do that another time. <coughs> this drink hasn't helped my throat at all. Oh shit. Um, had a drink in my hand. Not fair. Not fair. Dead now though, bitch. Did, did that skeleton just drop creeper dust? That's interesting. There we go. Carrots planted. See what else I've got to plant. It's not really that much help right now. What can I do that would be a help to getting this started? I could go skeleton hunting and get some bones to make it bone meal. And then start farming up things that aren't potato. All other sources of food would also be helpful. So let's kill some skeleton. Zombies. Come on, stop getting them mixed up. That's not a tough one. Yeah, slaughtered him. Uh, there's a creeper over there in my house. I think I'm going to go kill him. I think so. That was a big explosion from him. That's interesting. Broccoli seed. can probably go with my other broccoli seeds. Heading towards where that, um, whatchamacallit killed me. Oh, 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 level up. You notice more room for improvement. And you could take someone's head off with that, plus one beheading. Nice. That'll make um, more mobs drop heads, which will come in handy if I lose more death heads. So let's see what I can find and make drop a head. Like this zombie over here. It's about, oh, it's a baby zombie. That's a bit cruel. I don't want to decapitate a baby. Oh, shit. Oh, shit, the baby's coming at me. I'm going to have to decapitate it. Oh, shit, look at my hunger meter. I need to eat. Need food. Oh, crap. That zombie must have bitten me. I'm infected. That's why I'm so hungry. No, not really. This game doesn't have that feature. <clears throat> It'd be cool, though. It'd be cooler if I could get my throat properly cleared. Right. Oh, random hole in the ground. You know what I could do next? This place does need some pathways. I could make them. Tidy up the place a bit. And make it a bit more presentable. So let's grab out my cobblestone. Two stacks, that'll do more than enough. You stay out for the minute. I'll be coming out in a moment, I'll sort you out then. Split that between them. And... Yeah, more than enough. 
I might swap these out at some point, but I probably won't, because, uh, well, it doesn't uh, turn back into anything. Right, let's kill you. Now, here's how we're going to do the pathways. Just going to set it down one block and make it three wide. But I also want a little bit of um, space just at the front of my house to put some flowers and stuff. So I'm going to have a little channel coming up to my door. And then have it go either way from here. And this doesn't need to be thick, it's just a little bit of decorative space. And then, at the bottom here, go the steps. Not the steps, slabs. And that looks a lot more like a pathway. Well, it's a start at the very least. Gonna have to move that back a little. But that'll be fine when the time comes. Uh, light this place up a bit better when we get round to it. Let's keep digging along here. Get this pathway down to where it's going. That's actually a block raised, isn't it? That's going to be a slight issue. And we're not going too much for making the paths as um, neat as they can be. Just get into where we're going. You organise it a little too much and it starts to be um, actually more complicated than it should. Yeah, I did just dig up a seed there. So we're going to come out here. And we're going to have the path do a sort of slope up over here. I don't know why I said that like it was a question. Because it was not. So, gradual path going upness. And then, because we've got this pond over here, that might get in the way a little. Yeah, that gets in the way a little. Uh, so, we'll have that top of the step bit being the corner. <coughs> Block that back up. Don't know if I'm going to keep that pond forever. Not yet. What we can do is have it go a little bit diagonal when we get down. Actually, no, we can have it go sideways because it's got to go the other way anyway. For anything that might I might want to put behind my house, which is kind of most of it because you need the house to be at the front, but the fields can be in front of that. Otherwise, you'll get buildings blocking the front of your house and it'll all look horrible and you'll not be able to see where you're going properly. So buildings um, are all going to be going behind the house. Have I made that clear? Good. Sorry, that end was a bit, meant to be a bit of a joke, not having a go at anyone. <laughs> Could have seen either way. Right. I'm not even sure that I've got enough of these. I can always make more, though. It's only a bit of cobblestone. And then I place one stupidly and have to break it. That's fine. A bit more experience with the pick. Got a little bit of a gap around this side of the house as well, which is good. Not sure what we're going to do with it. Might be an alright spot for growing a bit of sugar cane. Alright. We've now got a path from the house to the smeltery. Just as day is dawning. Oh shit, 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 shit. Didn't damage my path though. That's fine. Bit more food from the sunbears. Let's have a look at what's going on over here. Yeah, we're going to have to move that back to tidy it up at some point. But it's not that point yet. Well, I guess it is that point there. Yeah. Give me more drops. Just like that. Oh, yeah. More droppies. More chilli pepper seeds. 
and some normal seeds that I can't pick up because my inventory is full. I need to find some more. Actually, I think I've got some more salt in one of my chests still, and that's fine as it is. I'm not going to redo that. Where's my salt? There's my salt. It's the wrong type of salt. The stacks won't combine. So let's put the mustard seeds away. There's some chili pepper seeds in there already. That's good to know. And we'll craft off that one lone salt into the zombie flesh. Which it sounds like I'm about to get some more of. Lag. Bugger off. Trying to make a video here. Can't be having lag. It's just not right. There we go. Dead zombie. Mm -hmm. I killed him as well, so he dropped more. Oh shit, I'm so hungry. I'm starving, but now I'm well fed. Yeah. How's that for weird? Let's, uh, use this up. And get eating on that. Then we should put the windows in to get them out of my inventory. Um, yeah, let's go do the windows. I should do some stairs inside at some point, not just like for the roof. And what I'm going to do, I'm going to put a long window here. So I can see out the front and I can look at my crops from up here. That's cool. Uh, I need to craft them into panes before I'll have enough. There we go. 20 panes. That should be plenty. Still got the web fe uh, well fed buff, which is nice. I didn't think it would last this long. Let's build that up a bit as well. <coughs> I know I shouldn't, I'll have an odd number of pains, I know, I know. But I want to. I like that. It's a nice little lookout. I have no idea how it looks from outside yet. But I'll find out at some point, and it'll all be fine. Let's have some smaller windows at the back as well. Don't need a window here in the middle, really. I don't need my pickaxe in my hotbar right now. And let's match it to the other side. And then let's just fill in this one. Fill in this one. No side windows needed. I don't know why. I just feel like it. And three. Let's do here. So we can just do a little look out and see who's out there. No. I don't like that can't see properly for one thing. How about one here and two on the other side? No, it's not symmetrical, I know, but it's not bad. It, it's practical. We can see out from it. Now, let's stand back and see how this looks. None of these have grown yet. Odd. It will be better when I've got a roof, because that looks a little misplaced. And the lack of walls inside is a bit of an off-putter as well. Hmm. I might have to alter that design a little bit. The second floor's too big, it doesn't need to be that big. I mean, what's in it? Bugger all. Really? Where's my glass? It seems to have swallowed some glass. Got some seared stone in there. I'd like to have more of that, to be honest. So, I could just chuck in a bit more. I can't even chuck in that much anyway, so let's just do that. Chuck in a bit more. 
Oh, it's not redoing my glass panes. Okay. Shit. Um, I'm going to have to find some other way of getting that out then. <clears throat> Probably by melting down more glass. Come on, Mez. It's not that hard. Let's drop them in there. Put my iron in there as well, because I don't need it. Um, what do I need? Not these crap. Um, I know they'll compact down into the other chest, so that's fine. Right, that's that sorted. What's going? Oh, oh, potatoes have grown. I'm going to break them because I need to um help that block die down a little, like that. There we go. What's going on over here? I'm just going to pluck these potatoes. I think it looks like I'm going to be making a field of potatoes. Break them. Let's just break this front line down. Because I don't need it anymore. It's getting in the way now. And I want it to be all normalified. Jump up and down on it and then it'll just flatten the land. Quickest way of doing it. <clears throat> or at least the laziest. And kind of fun. Actually, uh, maybe I shouldn't, because that will just be chewing up my hunger and spitting it out. Looks like something's grown over there as well, though. Oh, no. It's come uncropped as well. I can't retill the soil, can I? Not from here. Oh, that's a shame. Nothing's grown. Well, except those potatoes. It's alright, I'm not hungry right now. What I can do is start making a dedicated potato patch somewhere. I'm going to want some fences for that as well. So I'll work on that soon, but not immediately. Especially now that these trees have grown, and I've still got to finish off the house anyway. Oh, it's only one of them that's grown. Well, let's hack up the leaves and get some saplings. Or not get some saplings, as the case seems to be. What is with this pack and not giving... There we go. There's a sapling. Get it planted. No more? Apparently not. Bit more wood, though. I guess it's almost time to do a bit more roofing, but it's also almost time to end the episode, and so I can just do that quickly between episodes. That's fine by me. Hope it's fine by you, because it's what ha what's happening either way. Um, I'm not sure what I'm doing now. I'm grabbing this wild rhubarb, that's what I'm doing. And this wild blackberry. And I'm eating it, because look at my hunger, shit. Let's eat a potato as well. And there's some fruits up here as well, nice. Oh, that's on the right type of tree as well. I need to um, hang on to the next sapling I get from, from one of these and see what fruits I can combine it with to make it, you know, grow that tree. I think I've got a jungle sapling, so I might be able to do one of these. And then just have a fruit tree right outside my door. That would be really handy. So I'll hang on to both of them for the minute, but I will eat these blackberries. I know I can craft them into seeds, but I don't want to. I've got plenty of seeds haven't got fruit trees, and that's much lower maintenance. Right, how do I get down? I'll just take a bit of damage, I'll heal quickly anyway. <coughs> I miss the music. It's 
gone. Ugh. Come on! Just drink your water again. There we go. That's probably better. Doesn't sound it. Great. I think I'm just getting ill. Oh, cool. Stay planted and gave me four wheat still. What I'm going to do, I'm going to make one loaf of bread. And eat it. And turn the other lot into more seeds. The other, other wheat into more seeds. Then I can plant those seeds. I'm also going to eat whatever this is. Broccoli. Um, what can I do with it then? I could use it to make stock. I could use it to make a spring salad, but I'd need a cut chopping board and a mixing... How do I make a mixing bowl? Three pieces of wood and a stick. So I could make a mixing bowl and a cooking pot and some stock. I've not got the other ingredient I needed, have I? What was it? Hang on. So, with that we can make the stock. Where's it gone? Mixing bowl, pot, broccoli. Makes three lots of stock. Which we can make to use all sorts of stuff. Um, again, it needs the cooking pot. Oh, potato and salt. Oh, let's give this a go then. 